What do we love about joyriding buses? To us as bus enthusiasts, we also prefer scenery views. Let's take a bus and joyride with me! Oh, oh yeah, um, advertisement time. Wait, what's that right? I suck. I'm old man. Up. Hello, everybody. My name is Wang Yijin. So, um, yeah, I've tried buses and things happen. Ah! Besides buses, I also have a loss. Ah, yes, I also play Call of Duty. Here at the Heejin channel, we only accept the best subscribers. So, what are you waiting for? Limited time only. Hey, subscribe now. On today's episode of Joyride With Me, we are headed to the further east side where it's full of beaches, I mean beaches, recreation parks, and low bungalow houses, service 403. Back then, it was served as Passeris and Loop at Tampanese Road until modified to Loop at Passeris Park as a weekend bus service. It was classified as part services by SBS Transit for 5 years until it reconvert to a trunk service. Many people would recognize this bus service because it is the only bus service to stop right in front of the beach. From beach goers to ghost hunting, Service 403 carried on its legacy of being one of two bus services to serve along the beach. Unfortunately, it only has 3 buses running and it is under OTA. The U-turn roundabout is not exclusive for service 403 but it is something that we can appreciate. Vehicles parked by at the side of the main road so the bus got no choice but to drive in a wrong direction flow such as this. Luckily, you have service 68 that serves Elias Mall which only service 403 passes by as unidirection back then. Wouldn't it be cool if your house has a bus stop right in front? Thanks for watching today's episode of Joyride With Me. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. the ghost inside my head